Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome to another video and hope you guys are doing well today. Now, uh, I've not done a video for a little while and um, part of this is there's no major kind of theme behind this video other than a little bit of a catch up, say hello and talk about what's been going on. So uh, yeah, uh, we're in Battleground Blitz, which uh, in retail I'm playing Affliction Warlock. Um, I'm loving it. I'm having a grand old time. Uh, and this is the first Battleground Blitz I've done. I didn't even think it was queuable into War Within, but apparently it is now. So, uh, rated Battleground Blitz, that is. So, uh, yeah, let's get into it. Um, but yeah, so I've had kind of a couple of real-life things, which I mentioned in the last video I did. I'm back at home now. I came home yesterday. So, yeah, kind of trying to get back into it and, and figure what life looks like. That is a fantastical little uh, annoyance um yeah so wow i feel like i can't press buttons without just not being able to do anything i, I really couldn't tell you at the moment if i'm doing great or awfully which i think is an issue i'm gonna start pumping malefic raptures we absolutely decimated that rogue oh you scattered him so we got rid of my dots no uh at the moment i'm not really helping to the game, I'm just trying to not feed and kill some people. I'm going to die here. Am I going to die and be useful, though? That is the real question. Um, but yeah, so like I said, I've had some real-life stuff going on. I've just come home yesterday. Um, I say yes, I've been home like 12 hours at this point. Um, but yeah, so War Within's coming out very soon. Uh, I've been playing a lot of it while I've been away, thoroughly enjoying it, and kind of want to just keep playing more and more. So hopefully you guys are all right with that and enjoy this content, because I would love to be able to branch out and do all the different forms as well. Um, I've tried Shammy in like War Within, and I, it's just not for me, unfortunately. Uh, so if I am to play it, it's probably going to be as I'm in a horrible position. Yeah, let's get... That, that, and I'm still probably dead, aren't I? Yeah, we need to just regroup. Wow, we're getting absolutely smushed. So who's the, the target people we want to focus on? Warlock, uh, sorry, look, Pally, Rogue. But yeah, we just seem to be losing every fight. Uh, but yeah, let's say I want to do a lot more of this content um, to give you some idea of how much I've been playing. This character has been... Uh, 70 for a matter of like six, seven days at this point. Um, I've just gone and got Keystone Master yesterday. Like, I've been playing a lot. Like, uh, we might be able to actually do some a little bit here. Let's hopefully kill this hunter at least. Are we even meant to kill the hunter? Wow, do I just do no damage? What is this? Gonna mortal coil him for the healing and just to push him away from his team. Uh, try and get some dots rolling onto these guys. Ellie Shammy's at the moment, I've heard, are an absolute nightmare. So make sure we get a quick little uh, curse of tongues on him. I feel like we've already lost this point, though. Go for the slow on the rogue. Didn't get it. I don't know why that didn't go off. I'm going to try for the kick. Did get me. Oh, that was actually the Shemmy that got me fair play. Ready for the kick on the Shemmy. Not going to get it. Oh, he's rest, though. Oh, God, okay. That explains why he hasn't been punching me with Liver Burst every three seconds, I suppose. Try and do a little bit of damage to him here, but I think we're just over. Um, but yeah, like I said, so we've got arenas. Um, I've pushed a few arenas already, done some solo shuffle, done... I think we're like 6 and 12 rounds. 6 wins, 12 games played in solo shuffle. Um, obviously, 1,500 uh, rate in arenas. I want to be doing all that stuff. PvE, Mythic Plus, yeah, just everything. War Within. Probably only one character, which is a little bit different for me because I'm normally an alcoholic, but... Um, yeah. Get the kick on the Frostbolt. I've got a lot of dots rolling. And... 
popped a cooldown and wall for that. I think it's not going to make a difference, is it? Mortal Coil him off. Try and fear the rogue. We've got a little bit. Of... Wow, I just get absolutely globaled. <sighs> Wowzers. I mean, we're doing damage. There's people, like, just doing puck roll, really. Um, yeah, never mind. We lost our first game. It is what it is. Um, that's the, this is the build I'm playing at the moment. It's a bit of a test to build, to uh, try a couple of different things. Um, in actual battlegrounds, I've been doing really well. This is the first battleground I've done where it's like rated battlegrounds and I have been doing less well. I mean, got a few bits of damage rolling then, get the soul rip out. Need to stop using the wrong curse on the wrong person. I've been playing a little bit on the beta, and on the beta, one of the talents you can take as Hellcaller uh, allows you to combine your curses. So, like, Curse of Tongues, Curse of Weaknesses in one curse. So I've just been used to it being on one button, and I keep pressing the wrong one for the wrong target, which is a pure skill issue. There's, like, no excuse to it at all. But it is what it is. Uh, a little bit of damage onto the Hunter there. They finally let me start with a free cast. Never mind. Got to deal with this rogue. Going to try for the fear. Phantom Singularity. We've got a good amount of dots rolling on the rogue at the moment, but I don't know how long he's got till cloak. And he just doesn't take any damage. Jesus. Uh, I'm not sure if their healers are just god tier. Get the mortal coil out. Uh, soul rip him if I can. Get the... I don't even know if I'm going to get to it. Nope. Doesn't look like that's the case. Oh, little bit of lag. I mean, dude slaps this rogue. Like, fair play to him. All right, go away, buddy. No one likes you. Managed to dart packed before he jumped on me. Soul rip here into soul rot phantom singularity. If he doesn't die here, I don't know what else to do. Thank the Lord. Trink this, get a fear out as well as my staff proc. And I've got Dark Glare. A little bit of damage here, hopefully. Have got the Mortal Coil while he's on low health. Oh, I got the bubble off, though. Rogue is so annoying. We should be just taking other cards. Like, we shouldn't be fighting here, but I figured we've already lost. May as well get some kills in, right? It's our first one. Hopefully, it doesn't affect the MMR too much. Try and get the Phantom Singularity onto the Hunter. At least he can't take it off. You weigh Soul Rot and Soul Strip. He has got a lot of damage on him at the moment. Let's see if we can actually just burn this Hunter down. And who said Affliction Warlocks can't burst? Me. me. I did, because they can't, apparently. Well, he's running away from his healers. That's a good sign. Uh, rating unchanged. I mean, we can't lose rating, right? But um, not great. Maybe I'll try another one. Bear with me. So... For you guys, it's been all of about three seconds. For me, it's been about 20 minutes. Uh, but we're in another Battleground Blitz. Somehow with a higher MMR. Doesn't make sense. We lost the last one. How have I got a higher MMR? Never mind. Uh, so, like I said, um, I'm really looking forward to actually pushing this. Getting all the achievements and stuff, all the titles. It's going to be great. Uh, hopefully this one goes a little bit better. Can we see what's on their team? Oh, we're Alliance. Resto Druid. Rest oh, two Resto Druids. Okay. Interesting. Uh, hmm. Arcane Mage, Affley Lark, Marksman, Havoc Havoc. They've got so such a scary like ranged DPS, like Arcane Elemental Affliction Marksman, and then two Havoc Demon Hunters just to jump in and end everyone. 
it's kind of be going to be a little competition between me and this other affliction warlock potentially um i have been tempted to go for like a very very proc dot build so like running uh withering bolt ravenous afflictions and maybe even cunning cruelty but kind of just like playing off the proc shadow bolts but uh i don't know if i want to do that yet obviously this is all free at the moment in that like nothing this is all going to get reset with the new um season so it's a great time to try some stuff out uh so let's see what we can do here i do want to set up a nice little gateway and things in the middle um that's kind of my preferred place to fight i would also kind of like berserking but i don't know if anyone's gonna let me get it uh, they are, so let's go and get Berserking, because I feel like that on me is kind of a little bit scary. Demon Hunter over pushes, so let's just get dots and stuff on him. Uh, I'm over pushed, actually. I've double popped cooldowns. I really need my team to come in and save me. That's completely my bad being that out of position. Uh, we kind of turned it a little bit, though. We traded two for one. That was really bad for me. I overpushed because they overpushed. And I got greedy. Not great. Uh, Alliance flag's been picked up. That's actually ours. I hate the fact that they switch it all around. Like, uh, I mean, we're kind of doing okay in the fight, it seems. I'm coming behind them, which I'm not okay with. Get Soul Rip and some dots on him. We've got a good amount of dots out on people at the moment. That Warlock has ramped. Is that the flag already? Jeez. Like, I, I don't know what else to do when people are just running the flag that quick. He's cutting me out so I can't get the Mortal Coil. Get the Mortal Coil. Might be able to win the fight. Get the kick on the mage. So we're going to go 1 0 down. Uh, I can't help but feel I'd have done so much more in this fight had I been alive and maybe enough to win the fight. But I'm just not getting heals at the moment. Not great. Little demon hunter behind us. Finish him off nice and quick. Try and stagger him a little bit from his team. That's fine. He's got so many dots on him. I'd be surprised if he lives. What I want to do now is actually. Go and set up my pools and stuff that I actually wanted to do to start with. Uh, so one thing I do want to say with this, this is not like an expression of skill. This is not me going, look at me, look how great I am. Uh, like, I would like to get to a point where I'm making great plays and, and pushing high ratings and things like that. I'm not there yet. Uh, this is absolutely a learning curve. I've just come back to the game in general. So, um, yeah, I mean hopefully you guys can kind of learn and, and go through that process with me so the resto druid took our flag and the mage here is taking theirs so let's go and peel for him somewhat i've got a lot of damage in a sec actually if he can survive for a second but it looks like he's gonna go down oh is he i just hit very hard there okay stay with this one i'm gonna take it then i don't want to be the one taking it i feel like i need to be in the fights so at the moment, this Affliction Warlock is kind of slapping my booty. And I don't like that. I want to be the one booty slapping. Uh, but we can at least take it up there. We are in a good like, position as a Warlock to hold the flag just because of like being able to jump up and down and gateways around just to be annoying. Uh, Mage tried to make plays there. Going to Mortal Coil... Pre-fear, just in case he trinkets. I'm actually going to fear him again because he's just popped all of his cooldowns. So he's really trying to do something here. Pop Dark Pact and get out of line of sight. My priority is to just stay alive for a second. Nice sheep there, even though it removes my dots. And we played that really well. Like, we prevented him from doing his full dumb arcane burst. Can I have a gateway, please? We can't have a gateway. Okay. We're going to do that. 
get myself another health stone. I kind of don't want a healer with me. I want them to go and get the enemy flag back, but we'll see. Uh, I'm not scared of him if he wants to come upstairs, even with 70% increased damage taken. Uh, don't need anything else more than... <sighs> Stop sheeping people with my dots on. God damn it. I don't want to put too much into him in case more people come. Like, he's on his own. Oh, there we go. Go hand it in. Boom! 1-1. One, one. Back in the game. I feel like I've recovered my indiscretion at the start of the game. And, uh, yeah. So, I'm pretty sure I can slap this other Warlock if I get into a good team fight. Nice little kick on the chamois there. Get the Mortal Coil out just to stop him doing anything else. Boom, he is dead. Uh, so... I don't know how well I'd do it actually trying to get the flag and running it out. We do have their flag already. Uh, that druid is in a bad position to be doing that, in my opinion. I'm going to soul rip him, and I'm just going to kill this druid. I have so much damage on him right now. Kick the Evocate. Going to Dark Glare this as well, because they're both... Well, one's a high priority target, and the other one's very dangerous. So, um, But they're in a bad position at the moment. Get a UA up. Mage block ends now. Get Curse of Tongues on him as well. He's going to focus on me. Mortal Coil is Arcane Missiles. We have so much damage right now. As long as we can get the flag back to us, we're good. Uh, me not having the flag is I friggin' deal, by the way. Right, so we played that well. Uh, their flag carrier is just got yeeted. I don't know what happened there. Uh, Pet, come hither. So, I have no Dark Glare, but I do have Soul Rot and Soul Rip up. I really, really like Soul Rip. So, it reduces their damage done and healing received by 25% um, until they go and, like, recover their soul. But that's really hard to do sometimes. Gonna put that there and just get involved. Get the kick on the Druids. I have so much damage right now for this. Soul Rip, so he's receiving less healing. I've obviously got Dots rolling on both. Mortal Coil, the healer. Bear the healer off that. Make sure I get re-Dots uh, up on him. Even if the other guy gets it, I don't think it's a problem. I think he's going to die pretty quickly. I have got a Hunter hitting me, but he's just not the priority right now. Going to fear the Hunter off that. 2 1 up. And it looks like we might have recovered this game. I feel like the first fight was actually my fault. Which, obviously, don't like saying, but I'd rather say it and, you know, learn from it. I think over committing in that first fight and losing an Affliction Warlock in the first engagement just means we lose so much damage. So, going to go and get their flag. I'm going to run it back, I guess. Really interesting in 8v8 dynamic. Two healers, 60 PS, no tanks. Um, makes druids very valuable, I will say. I'm going to just cheat a little bit and gateway across the wall because I can't be bothered. Oh, I can't even gateway while I'm running. That's annoying. Oh, that's cool. Okay, that's really cool. Not going to put anything else onto him. The mage is super buffed. I've got so much damage going out at the moment. Boom, mage dead. Druid looking like he's going to follow soon. Going to mortal coil the Ellie Shemi and just trying to get our line of sight. Boom, he dies. I use Mortal Coil a lot, just like as 
a disruption tool more than a defensive. Obviously, it does heal, which is really nice. But um, where's enemy flag carrier? I feel like I'm about to get engaged on. I am. So into the Curse of Tongue straight away. Kicks me on my UA, so I'm just going to walk away right now. No point in me being in range if I can't hit him. Go and set up in our base. As long as we can go kill the enemy flag carrier, we are laughing. Uh, but yeah, considering the first game, I think one death, you know, one flag capture, another flag ran. Pretty happy with how we've played this game so far. So this gateway is completely useless. It's more a distraction tool. I want people to like hold that place in case I gateway away. I actually can't gateway with the flag, which I just learned. So, um, so empowered carrier, healer, and damage specializations are empowered while carrying this flag. Damage you take is reduced. That's pretty crazy, actually. So I'm very tanky while I've got the flag. Obviously, it's taking eighty percent more damage, so I'm somewhat tanky. What I might do is actually do this. Run around. There we go. Okay. Oh, the grip is elite. Full dots out as well. Show our healer some love. We are absolutely beating on this demon hunter. Like, just dots alone is enough to really put some pressure on him. Put a slow on him instead. He's got dots on. He just dies to them, I think. Don't even need to waste anything on him. Worst case, we hold the flag for another minute. Best case, they go and kill our the, the ESC. It's got 110% increased damage. This dude does scare me, though. Boom! Yeah. 192 rating, 100 conquest, 643 honor, some extra goods. Um, and our first Blitz Battleground win, I mean, we did like 11 mil more than everyone else. Um, almost double the other Warlock once we actually started getting into fights and getting relevant. Lots of killing blows, only one death. I feel like we played very well in that one. So guys, I'm back. More videos coming soon. Let me know how you like this sort of content within War Within. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Peace.